What's going on with the Farragut real estate market, February 2022? Hi, I'm Eric Whitener, broker owner of the Knox Fox Real Estate Group, and I've been in the industry since 2006, and I have seen a lot during that time, but I've never seen anything quite like this. And I wanna share with you the information on our local real estate market, so if you're thinking about buying or selling, you have the information you need to make the best decision for you. So let's talk about some local stats. Looking at the Farragut market for February year over year, new listings were down in February 21%, which means less homes came on the market than they did the same time last year. At the same time, homes going pending or under contract was down 19%. That might seem bad, but actually it makes total sense because there was less homes to sell. With that being said, supply of homes on the market is actually at an all-time low. We're looking at less than a month, actually more like two weeks. So what that means is if no other homes came on the market, buyers would run out of homes to buy in about two weeks. The average days on market or the time from when a home hits the market to the time it goes under contract is down to 21 days for the month of February. Another stat we need to look at are interest rates because they've risen dramatically over the last couple months. We're actually at pre-pandemic levels right now with interest rates, looking at the high threes and depending if you're buying a second home or investment, possibly the low fours. So what does all that mean? Well, if you're thinking about buying, I would recommend buying now, the sooner the better for a couple of reasons. One, we expect appreciation to be potentially in the double digit range again this year. So waiting means you're gonna buy a more expensive home later. The second thing is, is interest rates are expected to continue to rise. So right now where you're in the upper threes, you can expect by the end of the year to possibly be in the mid fours. So no matter what, waiting's just gonna cost you more money. So is now a good time to sell? Well, that really depends on your goal. If you're thinking about selling right now just to go rent a place, you know, wanna take advantage of the market and cash out, then I would not highly recommend that. The reason being is because, again, this year, we're expecting to see potentially double digits appreciation. So if you sell your current home, you're basically giving somebody else that asset and then they're gonna get that appreciation the following year. We also know that rent rates have gone up considerably. So selling your house to just go rent doesn't make a whole lot of sense unless you have a specific goal in mind. Now, if you currently own a home and you're thinking about moving up, that's the big win here because moving up into a higher price range is where there's gonna be less competition. So selling your home down here where all the buyer demand is and moving up into a more expensive, maybe bigger home is an ideal situation. That's something you would also wanna do sooner than later because that bigger home is gonna to continue to appreciate and interest rates will continue to rise over the year. Another good option could be new construction. We've seen people put new construction homes under contract and by the time the home is completed and ready to close, it's actually worth more than what they put it under contract for. This could give you the opportunity to get your home ready for market and take advantage of the market and at the same time potentially move into your new home already with equity. So that's the real estate market for February 2022. If you're thinking about buying or selling, our team at the Knox Fox Real Estate Group would love the opportunity to guide you through the process. You can either call or text us at the number below or leave a comment below because we'd love the opportunity to talk to you about your goals and what you're looking to do. I'm Eric Whitener with the Knox Fox Real Estate Group. Thanks for watching.